Hi, it's Peter from Do It Yourself Full Range Hi Fi Speakers. This is the Flugel, Frugal Horn build. These are the Mark Audio Pluvia 7 drivers that were sent to me by my client. Very nice drivers. I don't know what they're worth, but you can look them up. Now, this is the drawing of. Um, the Mark Audio and their Planet 10, I think, site. I, do, I made some modifications. Um, you can see them there. What I might do is put a link to a gallery uh, on Google Drive with more of these photos so you can open them up in a static version. Uh, there's the cut list. I made some slight changes to that as well, just for convenience. Now, um, this is the plywood I use. It's 15 millimeter BC plywood, so it has one very nice clean side, and the other side, you know, has a few knots in it. I don't mind the knots actually. They actually give the wood a bit of a character, but I've kept the nice clean side for the outside panels of the carcass of the speakers sides and the and the bottom um, as you'll see I've put on the front a uh, and top a hardwood veneer now this is my very cramped workspace uh, the full size sheet was quite difficult to cut in this space, but with a bit of effort, I uh, got it done. So just make uh, those three big cuts initially, just so you can get the panels back into your car. And I took the main panels to my woodwork club to do all the finer cuts. Now here you can see a template I made for the back curved edge. I made that out of another piece of hardwood um, using a different radius than the standard one on the design that I downloaded. I changed it just to vary the appearance a little bit. I think it looks better. The, um, then I used a router with an tr uh, edge trimmer to trim the plywood to the template and then a fair bit of sort of hand sanding. Um, using the template piece as a guide for the sanding to try and get as good a smooth curve as I could. That seemed to work out fairly well and I was pretty happy with the result so that's part one um, I'll do a part two just with the glue up um, and some of the lessons I learnt from that and then part three will probably be uh, to do with the driver install and the polyfill and then uh, I'll talk about the finish in maybe part four see below for the link to the Google Drive photos gallery and um, please like and subscribe I hope you enjoyed the video thanks